So first things first, apologies for the last six months. I have been an absolutely awful vlogger slash video maker. I moved down to Southampton in October and alongside my PhD, I started a full-time job as well, which took up a lot of time. I've now got to the position where I've finally submitted my PhD. Woohoo! So I've decided to start doing the videos again. And it's a pretty mad time to start doing them, to be honest with you. Whilst I always knew I was going to be handing in my PhD at around hmm, the end of March, I didn't quite realise that I'd be doing it from home by email and the immediately after the two weeks annual leave that I'd taken, I would still be at home working from home. So for the next few videos, maybe even a few months, who knows, um, this is going to be my studio that I'm doing my vlogs from. I would give you an MTV crib style tour, but to be honest with you, it's one room and a bathroom and you don't wanna see that and I don't particularly wanna show you. So you just have to trust me that there's nothing really exciting to see. I've been doing a bit of thinking about the direction that this series of videos, vlogs could possibly move in given the situation that we're all facing. And two things strike me really. Firstly, if you're working in education and university outreach and that type of stuff, then you've probably got a bit more time on your hands to do some reading. So every two weeks, what I'd like to do is a quick research roundup. Now, this will include different journal articles that I find particularly interesting on different bits and bobs from education, books that are being released that I think might be of interest to practitioners, and also things perhaps that are just going on in government with regards to education policy or higher education that I find particularly interesting. What I might do actually is a video telling you all about my PhD research as well, which is around white working class males and how they negotiate their expectations for the future in education and work. Something else I'll be looking at doing is developing new content and videos that are geared towards supporting students who will be making decisions around a progression to higher education in some really, really difficult circumstances. It's horrible for young people who are trying to make these choices at the moment. The rug has been pulled completely from under them. And what I would like to do is use this channel as a bit of an opportunity to provide some hints and tips, whether that be regards to university progression itself or keeping well mentally and emotionally, uh, different things that universities might be doing to help and support students that you can look out for too, as well as third sector organisations like the Sutton Trust or the Brilliant Club who have pulled together some really great resources. So that's the shape that the vlogs are going to take kind of over the next few weeks and months from my home office studio. Um, this video really just to check in and say hello and I'm back. I'm sure you're all whooping in excitement. So keep an eye out over the next few days for a new video that's going to be published. Haven't quite decided what topic it's going to be on yet, but hopefully you'll find it really interesting. Keep safe, keep well, and that's it for now.